is serving up some positive news tonight. McDonald's wants its fast food to raise fast money for their Ronald McDonald House charity. NBC Miami's Christina Hernandez has more on what you can do to change lives with the extra change in your pocket. With her feeding tube still in, Angela Bushi enjoys a happy meal and the toys at McDonald's. The six-year-old just had a liver transplant in December. She came here for a transplant, for a liver transplant, and she was very sick. She couldn't, she couldn't make it. Patrick Bushi and his family live in Jacksonville, but Angela was cared for in Miami. Thanks to the Ronald McDonald House, the Bushis were able to stay in this home away from home for months while their daughter was healing. Bushi says he doesn't know what they would have done without the charity. You can take showers. I mean, you have a room, you have a bathroom, you have a nice kitchen, you can cook and everything, you know, and stuff there is, you know, very nice to us and very good place, you know, it helped us a lot. And this is how it's all possible. Change for the heart. Starting today and lasting all week, every South Florida McDonald's will have a Coke bottle to collect money for a third Ronald McDonald house. The charity's executive director, Soraya Moya, says one in Fort Lauderdale and one in Miami isn't enough. We help so many families. We actually have a waiting list of families trying to use our services. So a second house in Miami might be really a good option as well. The Ronald McDonald House also wants to beat a world record for the most coins donated to a charity. $235,000 worth. Pennies that add up to something Bushi says you can't put a price on. To help somebody when they're going through a lot with their kids and, and very, very bad disease and stuff like, like, like our daughter. Today kicks off the Change for the Heart donation drive. The goal is $3 million. So if you can help out, just log on to our website, NBCMiami.com, and we'll tell you how. I'm Christina Hernandez, NBC North Miami Beach.